What is going on guys? Hey, my name is Timothy with Timothy's Mobile Home Tours and today I'm out here at Barrica Homes here in Delaware and uh, man, I've been, they've got three beautiful models on here on site and I've just been checking them all out. This one right here, I also like. This one's a little bit smaller than the other two, but I think you're gonna like it just as much. Let's go ahead and turn you around, check out this home. All right, this is the Angle side by Barrica Homes. It is a three bedroom, two bath, 1500 square foot beauty. Now, the floor plans that I have been showing you are some that they have in their books, but at the same time, you can take and bring your own floor plans to Barrica Homes. They build on the Delmarva Peninsula, and they can build it to suit your needs. You know, whatever you like, they can come up with, help you design it. They have a design team on staff they're gonna spend time with you, figuring out what you want, letting you bring your dreams and ideas to life. And then on top of that, they have a whole bunch of uh, stuff in their design studio to help you pick out all these beautiful finishes. Now I did bring Cody along with me today, as you can see. He has this bright green, beautiful cast, as goes with kids. So he gets to be daddy's little assistant today as we check out some of these amazing homes. All right, so you've seen the outside. It's beautiful. Now we're gonna go look at the inside. And one of my favorite thing about all these homes is just the color of the doors. We've seen powder blue, this like sea green, just beautiful. Now the porches on these homes, again, they come standard and you can have them done up in a variety of different ways. Now, when you first come into this home, it is beautiful. Nice little open concept. One great big room. I know a lot of people aren't a fan of it, but I like it in this type of home just because, I mean, 1,500 square foot isn't small by any stretch of the imagination. But for me personally, it's nice to be able to chat back and forth with everybody, you know, especially if we're like hosting parties or events or something. That for me, that's just kind of what I would see. That's why I like it. This home definitely feels very modern. I love the gray cabinets. <laughs> so coming into your little dining room space. Great big area. Obviously you can get a really nice size table in here. And then outside you can actually kind of see we're right at their factory. And these are a lot of the different parts of the modular home, so the different sections. Really beautiful. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? I was actually talking about this, but I was finishing a thing. Y'all know how I get, I get, I'm scatterbrained. I don't know what's happening. Anyway, all right, so you do have granite countertops. And look at this matte finish look to all your appliances. I'm gonna go and show you in just a second. Really cool. Then you have your undermount sink. Looking out that beautiful back window. And don't we all just kind of wish that right there, that little pond came standard with all these homes. I do anyway, you don't have to. And then the tile, beautiful, beautiful tile. Tim, you say beautiful more than anybody I've ever heard of. Yes, I know. I get paid to say beautiful. No, I'm just kidding. Nobody pays me to tour these homes. I do it myself. I travel around on my own dime to bring you some beautiful homes. And of course, you can always help support the effort by becoming a member or checking out some of our fancy new merchandise or, you know, just simply hitting that like button. I greatly appreciate it when you guys do that too. 
Now, a lot of these homes, yeah, they've been hi having little, little hidey things. You got the pull out pot and pan thing, I guess, right here. Whew. So this home, it's forcing me to go through all the drawers. Now, soft clothes can be uh, put in these homes, in this particular model. The other models that we toured, they did have the soft clothes. Now, coming around the island, you do have a, an outlet on this side. And also an outlet on this side. Now, let's look at this. I'm telling you, see, it's like a cool little... It's different. It's not black. It's not silver or anything. Really cool. All right, now we have a closet. It's almost like your coat closet when you come in. Not quite. The only thing is no pantry currently in this home, but of course you can always find a place to put it. You could scrap this little coat closet right here and that could become your pantry. And coming down the hallway, you have your washer and dryer closet, your utility closet. And your water heater. And then all three bedrooms are back on this side of the home. So coming into your first one, currently set up as an office, but I'm sure you can imagine a bedroom. Bertang. And by now you've already seen the size of this room. I will make sure to put it up on the other two rooms. Now this one. Now the carpet in the bedrooms comes standard, but you can always upgrade. If you're not a fan of carpet, you can always upgrade to the, the vinyl plank floors. I know a lot of people like. Like, you know, I'm on the fence. It's easy enough to vacuum, you know, and I hate sweeping. Sweeping aggravates the crap out of me. <laughs> really angry about it. Like, I hate sweeping. This is your guest bathroom, second bathroom. You have your shower and your vanity. But, <laughs> all right, let me show you this and then I'll finish. I'll finish that. You have your linen closet. Like to me, I would almost rather vacuum than sweep, you know what I mean? Because I feel like with the vacuum, you can just get everything up. Sweeping, especially if you got like pets. We got a dog and uh, yeah, gracious. All that hair just gets trapped everywhere. And you're always finding clumps of hair everywhere. I'd rather just scoop it up with the vacuum cleaner. I don't know, that's, that's my thoughts on it. Let me know down in the comments what you think. <laughs> what you like, carpet or vinyl plank or hardwood, you know, a harder surface floor, I wanna know. Tim, there you go, he ran one again. I know, I just, I had to get that out. I had to get it off my chest. Plus you can lay down on carpet and be comfortable. All right, coming into the master bedroom, bathroom. Dang it, Tim, the master bathroom. Double vanity. You have your toilet nook. Your shower. And your linen 
hanging closet. Now again, I have toured three beautiful homes here at Berica, and the finishes in all these homes have just been absolutely beautiful, especially the haymaker. So y'all go check those out on the channel and we'll hop into some prices. You see this shirt right here? You can have one too. Over on the store tab on the main channel page at youtube.com slash Timothy P. Livingston. Pick yourself one up today and then tag me in it over on Instagram at Timothy P. Livingston. And let's see how many people we can be twinning with. You know you want to do it. Hey, this is the Ingleside by Berica Homes. It is three bedroom, two bath, 1,500 square foot. Berica Homes builds in the Delmarva Peninsula, on the, on the Delmarva Peninsula, which consists of Delaware, Eastern Shore, Maryland, and Northern Virginia. Now you could probably get them to go a little further out if you wanted to. It's just gonna cost you a little bit more. If you wanna know a little bit more about Berica Homes, you can find their link in the description below. Now the Ingleside is gonna start out at about $207,000. Of course, that price can vary depending on any upgrades or modifications that you want to the home, where you plan on placing the home, or any taxes or extra county fees that may be associated with moving the home to your location. So let me know what you think about this home down in the description below. If you wanna check out another home by Berica Homes, you can click on this video right here. If you're new to the channel, I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, beautiful homes, and uh, I hope to see you here. As always, guys, my name's Timothy, and I'll see you in the next one.